amazing. These come highly recommended. Thank you. Let's go. However, What are you doing? We've been spotted. <laughs> Stop right there. I can't believe this. Send a message, boy. Either we give ourselves up, or these innocents pay the price. But the only one who could know we survived, and the only one who could send soldiers after us. Oh, come on, let's move. Stop right there! Oh, I can't believe this. This is bad. who never went up to the fort itself, after all. It couldn't have been anyone else. Who would have thought three sorry stragglers 
would make it past a whole unit of assassins. Bastard! You never intended for anyone to survive. You knew the human would be there. Naturally. You heard the reports. I only put more bait on the hook. Though I wasn't expecting that damn thing to be rampaging already. You sent those soldiers to their deaths. Why? Because the Kingdom's Guard is powerless before the humans, and only a pile of bodies will prove that to the public. So someone wants the King's Guard disgraced. And when the people need him most, a savior rises as their shield. Is that your game? Savior? Speak plain, boy. You think he's one of Luis's men? A pitiful flock needs its shepherd. If a little blood is what it takes to show them who their real savior is, then that's a price easily paid. That's why those sons and daughters die. For your savior. <laughs> they aren't the first. The soldiers cry for reinforcements. The villagers plead to be spared. But I know better than to confront a human. A... a village? You refused. Wait, then you were the one who... Seven years ago, the first flames day of June, a village in the northern hills was razed to the ground. A village called Harlia. Hmm? Oh yes, that might have been a name. Then you made a fatal mistake, Klinger. You left one survivor! Stay back! Help me! Ugh. You played right into our hands, you know. <clears throat> this was the only road without checkpoints. A simple deduction. You're a disgrace to your title. I may not make it out alive, but as for you, you're hopeless! O oh, thou who art seared with bitterness, O oh, thou anguished traveler, it is time for thou to choose thy path. O oh, Lodestar, whose light reveals the king's own path, awaken! Without him, I've got nothing left. You struggle in vain. I won't let you rob me of my glory. This is the way of the real world, little lordling. You call this real? Leaders abandon their people, and the innocent die by their scorn. If that's the real world, then it can die alongside you. <laughs> My name is Leon Stroll de Halliatus. My home and my family were taken from me. I am the last of my house. I am the last of my noble bloodline. And in the name of my people, I will strike you down where you stand! I will show you a world with honor! What is this? Wait! He's got power like yours now? Well, better show him how to use it! I don't know what you think you're doing, but I'll not cave to an empty threat like that! This ignite is all I need to turn you to ash! You lot, get to it! Cover me! So he scampers off to protect himself, and his subordinates get to be his living shields. The man's showing his true colors. I'll fix the filthy coward with the end he deserves. The Igniter's powerful, but it takes care and calculation to wield. If you sense danger, steal your defenses and endure it. Ah! 
Don't resist, Lola. They won't hold back! Wind! I tire of this. I call upon royal power within. I'll cut you down. Not done yet. Take this. I will seek her! Scour! Warrior! Hack and slash! It's okay. Come forth, royal soul! Nowhere to run! Critical hit! I refuse! Warrior! Yeah, I'll cut cool. you down! Don't die hard! Gah. Die! 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 You! You! Die! Seeker! We're not out of this yet! I owe you. Take this! Please! That will do. I'll strive for greater heights. Nice. I feel stronger already. I found new power. Did a commissioned officer would end up a wild-eyed zealot. How... how did I do all that? And without an igniter? Just like him? Who are you two, really? I... I'm Leon Strong. Just a fallen noble from the countryside. Back there, Klinger mentioned a village that was raised by a human. They sent for help, but he abandoned them. Talia was its name. I'm the son of its lord. And now I know what really happened. We sent our fastest riders, but... We were doomed from the start. If Luis was behind it, then that's all I need to know. He's the one who will answer for it. I have my own reason to fight now. I don't want to be an ally of convenience alone, so once more... Please, let me join your cause. <sighs> what do you say, Grius? <sighs> I see keeping an eye on you was too much trouble in the first place. So you've no objections? What say you, friend? Remember this. Now, onward. The proud noble, strong. Within him dwells the virtue of the warrior. Nurture thy bond with him, and a new power yet slumbering within thee may awaken. Together we stand. Did you feel that just now? What's going on? Does it have something to do with that odd magic? 
Now that I think about it, once you awakened, isn't it weird that Stroll followed not long after? What does this mean? Huh? Wait, what? indeed. Somehow you find yourself here once more. And a fairy. I thought their kind long extinct. Do they yet take refuge in the Elden Sanctum? Hey! You gonna talk to me or just at me? We meet again, my friend. Though admittedly sooner than I'd expected. Remarkably, another has awakened. What miracle is this? Yes, that same power now stirs in your companion. Another of the mighty archetypes. Do you recall our discussion earlier about how archetypes are an original form of magic? Um, well, more or less. Consider this. As an elder, you are an outcast of society, yes? Your very identity is a kind of destiny you may defy but not escape. All mortals suffer under the weight of our burdens. But in facing and embracing that anxiety, you make it your innermost power. You find freedom. And so, the lives of those who overcome their hardships and embody the virtues within are passed down as heroic tales. Your companion, too, had his eyes open to his true path and claimed its virtue. That awakening is your doing. He awakened to the archetype that protects you. Hey, hold on a second! Who even are you? How much do you know? I'm warning you, if you mess with him, you're gonna have to go through me! Ah, you two share quite a deep connection, don't you? Well, we didn't always. But now we're partners to the end. We're linked down to the depths of our hearts. Right? Right. We trust each other. I've got his back and he's got mine. And that's all there is to it. The mystical fairy, Gallica. Within her dwells the virtue of the mage. Nurture thy bond with her, and a new power yet slumbering within thee may awaken. I won't lead you astray. That's the whole reason I'm here. Hey, wasn't that... Fascinating. Do you understand what just happened? By connecting with others who have found their resolve, you awaken to new strength. And further, you and all your allies may fight with the strength of any archetype in your circle. As an example, your other companion, the fellow with the eye patch, he seems to have some training and knowledge regarding the wielding of an archetype. By his own account, nothing came of it. Yet if you so desire it, you can awaken the true power within him. What? You mean Rias could use this power too? The nature of the Seeker. No. Perhaps it is simply your own nature. You truly are remarkable. If you seek answers, then go and claim them. This right here. Now then.
that means. Now then. This power... This right here. Sure. Of course. I didn't think I could grow anymore. Fascinating. That is... That's a good giddy. Hmm? This cat, you see. Hmm? 
That's a good boy. That is... This place... Oh. 
Uh, hold on. Sack? Good of you to come. Does this worry you? That's a good boy. What would you care to know? It appears that... What would you care to know? Hmm. What would you care to know? Hmm.
What would you care to know? My young friend, 
You are truly as remarkable as I first believed. Others fated to awaken to their own power will be naturally drawn to you. To reach the lineage of power's greatest potential, you must acquire more archetypes and bring them together. After all, a hero without allies is nothing more than a lone dissenter. To save the many, you must learn to fight with the power of many. Only a champion of the people may awaken the power of heroes, and with it, seize a future of their own making. <sighs> when next you come to see me, I hope it shall be of your own volition. Open my book, then let your imagination conjure this place anew, as vividly as you can make it. I'm sure that will be enough to reunite us. As long as you walk your path, I shall faithfully watch over you. May we meet again. What? Where are we? You two all right there? Looked as if you were in some kind of trance. Trance? Wait. Have we been here this whole time? It was strange. As if I felt something in the air. My senses sharpened near tenfold. It reminded me of my old days studying magic. What? So that wasn't a dream. Grius, that's probably his power. You studied back at the Sanctum, right? I know you couldn't get the hang of it then, but... I think we might have just awakened it. Awakened it? But that... Who are you people? The truth, if you would. Look, in all honesty, we barely know any more than you do. But the short version is... Well... I think you can use that power now. Uh, I think you might be right. The way it feels is... Well, this is magic, eh? I'd all but given up on it, but... Fate had other plans, it seems. Enough. We must move on. There is far to go still. And lad, I follow your lead now, at least when it comes to how we use these skills in battle. We haven't the luxury of time to train with magic. Same here. You've clearly got a sense for this, and I'd rather make myself useful than muddle your strategies. Five days until the funeral. That's precious little time, and we'd best not waste it. Look! What's up?
I'm highly recommended. Thank you. Oh. 
Bye.